guys welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new I'm simply unique and you are watching another Sims 4 video so today I am back with yet another speed build for you guys and it has been a while I have done one on Monday as you guys might have seen but before that I did quite a bit of CAS videos for you guys things that are CAS related and that is mainly because sometimes I just get uninspired and I don't really always know what to build but I am back with yet another speed build like I said and today I am building a cabin for you guys which I call pine wood cabin sometimes I would go and ask my husband what do you think I should build because like I say I do get like uninspired sometimes and I don't know what to build so he was always nagging on me to build a cabin but an actual log type of wood cabin and I just figured you know what the heck let me do that so then I went on Pinterest to find something that I can build because sometimes I do go and build from reference pictures which is totally fine because let's face it guys I'm not the most talented builder out there and I do tend to build from reference pictures so I went and looked for pictures and I came across this nice cabin it was like a wood cabin exactly like this one but somewhat a little bit different because unfortunately with the game they are not always the same features to create the house exactly like the reference picture but I feel like the house actually came out looking a lot like the reference picture itself so I will be putting a picture up for you guys on the screen so that you can see how it looks like I do feel like I didn't build it in the right location if you guys know what I mean I feel like it would have been better to build it in Granite Falls or even on Sulani um, because it is like a cabin and you do get beach cabins as well I do feel like it's not that bad the location itself um, it has a lot of greenery and that's something I go more towards I really like greenery and you know the lush trees and things like that so <laughs> that is mainly what I go towards and then of course I need some beautiful lighting so that you guys can actually see what I do so that is why I normally build in Willow Creek as well as Newcrest because I find that the best lighting are in those worlds but there are some other worlds uh, in the game that has better lighting as well or just as good lighting as these worlds I'm rambling <laughs> I know <laughs> I feel like sometimes I just don't get to shut up but yeah so initially when I built this cabin I wanted the exterior to look the same as in the reference picture however I always tell you guys I do tend to make a build my own and that is why you guys will see I added a lot of trees and I wanted it to have the woods feeling that is why I kind of say it would have been better to actually build it in Granite Falls because there are so many trees around and it just would have looked so much better but nonetheless I did end up adding a lot of trees giving it that woods feeling and then you will see of course the exterior as well as the interior walls or the same it is wood because this is actually just a wooden cabin it is a one bedroom one bathroom cabin and it's fully furnished and I feel like it is very fancy for the inside but I feel like this would be your typical five star cabin if you was to go on vacation or things like that so I feel like this is the type of cabin that your sim would take out a lot of money out of their wallet just to spend some time here now however this could be a cabin that you place in Granite Falls as a rental cabin or you can just have your sims buy it and live in it and live the luxurious cabin life now you can always place it in a world like Brindleton Bay as well as Windenburg because those walls also have like a woodsy type of theme to them some areas I feel like this house would look nice on the island of Windenburg that little small island but yeah that's just me but there are so many locations this house or this cabin could have looked good in but uh, <laughs> I just built it in Willow Creek I did end up adding a laundry room in the kitchen like in the little corner you guys will see and I love how the interior turned out because I went for a lot of wooden things you know just to stick to the wooden cabin theme and I really like how it turned out I feel like I do say this in each and every video <laughs> that I like how my builds turned out I guess you 
have to love your bills yourself, otherwise how will someone else like them? I tend not to boost my own horn or toot my own horn, but I do like how my bills turn out. When I look at my older bills and things like that, I feel like my bills have come a long way, but I feel like they can still go a long way if that makes sense. So I ended up adding a lot of portraits on the walls so that your sim can add their own actual family photos in and I went for a lot of bright colors in the house for the living room as well as the dining room. I just overall like my bright colors, you guys know this by now. <laughs> if you're an oldie here and you're part of the unique family you would know that I am a color freak so I tend to do bright colors in my builds just to make it more happy and lively so yeah. So I went for a lot of oranges, yellows, bright blues just to make the build look happy and I added a lot of plants as much as I could actually and there was even a little space for a computer it's like a desk with a computer and things like that now you guys will see that this build probably is not on the gallery yet I don't know because for some reason the gallery is having some issues once again what else is new so what I did is I actually have a sim file share account so I placed the tray folder for you guys in there so you guys can actually just go in the description click on the link that says download and it will take you directly to my sim file share where you can download this house and just place it inside of your tray folder and when you go into your library the house will be there so this house has no CC in it so you guys can definitely go and check it out I will try to upload this house onto the gallery as soon as it's functioning again but uh, yeah if you are in a hurry to get this build you are always welcome to click on the link in the description and like I said it will take you to my sim file share where you can get this build so let me know in the comments down below what you guys think do you like this build would you like to play with it in your game i always like to hear from you guys in the comments so if you like this video don't be shy give it a thumbs up and if you have not already you know what to do go hit that subscribe button as well as the bell for notifications to be informed and updated on the latest and newest videos that i post on my channel and if you have subscribed thank you so so much it really means a lot to me if you want to become a friend of mine and join my global gamers discord as well as the facebook group the links will be in the description so go and check it out go click on it and i hope to see you guys there so i hope you guys have a super duper awesome day wherever you are stay safe and i will see you all next time enjoy the rest of the video bye